Hi, this is Court for Court's Crafts from May Arts Ribbon, and I'm excited to share with you a very quick tutorial today. This is um, cross stitch, which I have no idea how to do properly, so if you're looking for like a real cross stitch tutorial, this probably isn't it. But for paper, I've made it work. Um, I'm using May Arts Ribbon, it's SM, it's actually burlap string, and I've chosen five different colors. And this is just a uh, cut file, and I've already finished the first one and put tape on the back. I'm on the second one, on the A for happy. And so basically uh, what I did incorrectly the first time is I made the squares here individually, and what I ended up finding out is that you want a continuous stitch so that you can actually read the letters when you're done with it. So that's the main thing is you have to go back through these holes a second time and sometimes more. So I am going to go ahead and keep going with this and show you a couple stitches. But I thought the burlap string made a really fun um, and earthy look to what's normally a very clean looking um, art form, cross stitch. So I chose the burlap string for that reason. There are plenty of merits options if you want the clean look. That you don't have to use thread, you can actually use a very thin ribbon. Um, which would be also very pretty. Um, you can also use a wired string, which would give it a very crisp look. So all I'm doing is going in and out the back, and then I'm coming back up through this hole that I've already used before to make the stitch continuous. So I'm doing each letter a different color, and I think that will give it a very springy look uh, for Easter, and it does take some time. Cross stitch is a very slow process, um, but I was excited to do some cross stitching because I love the movie Pride and Prejudice, and the girls are always cross stitching in there. Um, and I learned when I was in third grade and thought, of course I know what I'm doing, but I didn't. So <laughs> I am relearning. And um, I hope whoever receives this card from me for Easter, which is probably going to be my grandmother, appreciates the time and love that I put into it because it is definitely a labor of love. Okay, well this is Court for Courts Crafts again for May Arts Ribbon and using the code SM online and there's a variety of colors. I hope you try this method out for yourself and make a card this way or a home decor piece. Have a beautiful day.